This demonstration will show you how to uh, bring in a G-code file, save the offsets, and then make changes to that G-code file without losing your offsets. So let's first bring in a, a G-code file and set it up. I'm just putting some fictitious numbers in there, but these would be your, your offsets. Set your toolpath and check it. And now you'd be able to run the part. So let's go now to program in and out and let's save this program. And you notice it's going to save the G-code program as a PTG file. Hit save. And when you do that, it creates two new folders, a GCD folder and a pictures folder. So what's important now is when you make a change to the G-code file, let's, let's just uh, get this G-code file up here. You can see it over here. Is I'm going to take this file now, and we can see our we can see our Z's at uh, negative half inch. Let's change that to negative one and a half inches. And now we're going to save this new file. We're going to go into our GCD folder, this folder that is created, and save it here. Overwrite the old one. Now. We're going to open up that PTG file and we're going to go to our G code editor and you'll see that this is now negative one and a half inches. So when you make a, a change to your file, to your G code file, you want to save your changed file in the GCD folder and whatever folder your file name was, save it in there. That way, when you go to bring in a program, bring in the PTG file, it instructs the, the this, this, there's instructions in here that tell it to go to the GCD folder and to get, go to the GCD folder in this folder and get that new G code file. So if you do that, you'll see my fixture offsets are all the same except for You'll have to set, you'll have to tell it which fixture plate you're working on because it doesn't know if this is a different fixture plate or not. So this is a good safety feature. And then the second thing you'll have to do is make sure that the tool that's been saved with the program, you want to match up the ATC location uh, just in case it's been changed. I mean, this might be three, four months down the road. Uh, and someone has changed uh, tool positions in the carousel, well, you want to make sure that your description here and your type and location match the ATC. That's it. Thanks for watching.